Okay, so today I want to tell you a story about corduroy, but first I'd like to tell you a story about myself and the woman who gave me this doll, this corduroy bear. This corduroy bear was given to me by my Aunt Diane. She passed away a few years ago, uh, but she loved children's books. And she gave me many children's books, children's book type gifts. I have an autographed copy of Amelia Bedelia, um, Sarah Pine and Tell, and my corduroy. But what was really cool about my Aunt Diane, she was a kindergarten teacher. So when I was four, I got to go practice being a kindergartner. So, you know, just to get ready for the real thing, I was super excited. My sister had been to school, and I knew it was the cool thing to do, and I couldn't wait to go. So, you know, I got dressed, and I went with my mom, and we went to kindergarten. And I loved it. I loved everything about it. I loved circle time. I loved the playhouse with the little stove and everything. I loved songs. I loved playing. I loved it all. But what I was really excited about was recess. Recess, I knew, or I had heard, was the best part of school. So I was really excited for recess, but it had been raining all day, and I'm like, oh no, the rain is gonna ruin recess. I won't be able to go outside. Well, luckily it stopped raining, and I gotta go outside for recess. And what did I do as soon as I got out there? Went straight for the big toy. I'd played on big toys before, at my sister's school, and at the playground, but this is my first official recess big toy time. And I was excited. Maybe a little too excited, because I went on the slide, and I don't know if it was excitement or just the fact that I was a practicing preschooler, or not a or practicing kindergartner, not a real kindergartner. I didn't notice the giant puddle at the bottom of the slide. Oh. <laughs> and I was out of it unavoidable. I couldn't I couldn't avoid that puddle, and I landed right in the muddy puddle, and I was soaked. I was soaked, and on my very first exciting day of practice kindergarten, I had to wear clothes from Lost and Found. <laughs> you would think that this might have ruined the day for me. You would think that maybe this would have turned me off school forever. <laughs> but it didn't. I still loved it. I still loved everything about it. And I told my mom on the way home, I'm like, Mom, I love school. That was great. And next year when they do why, I don't even need to go because I'm covered. I learned all about the yellow yaks today. <laughs> so that, that day and this bear are two things that my Aunt Diane gave to me. 